everyone. It's me again, Happy Jen, and I'm just checking in with you all today to give you a little tip when you're having a bad day. Um, I allowed someone to get me in a bad mood today, someone very close to me, and it's just continued throughout the day because then I just got stuck inside of my head and I just kept thinking about what happened and what was said or wasn't said and how all kinds of craziness and it just escalated into more craziness in my head. So um, I'm sure that you're going through this at some point in your life and if you have not, you will eventually. I hope you don't, but we all do. And I just wanted to tie this into another thing that I've been going through recently, which is trying to uh, be responsible more for myself for my own emotions and my own outcomes in life as well as my own healing and changes that just need to be made, uh, personal changes. So all of this ties into the fact of being a sovereign being and what I mean by a sovereign being is total and full. Um, your, the, your own boss, you know, the one who is in control of your own life, the person who is responsible for your own healing. And I just decided in, instead of really letting it take me to a place I didn't want it to, I was just going to go and write out some affirmations and focus on those affirmations for the rest of the day. Um, I did use a little bit of that in prayer meditation yesterday to assist me with some healing that I needed and it worked pretty good I can say it worked pretty good and so these are the affirmations that I've been using all day maybe you would like to use them for yourself number one I am a sovereign being I think that's very important for you to know and to believe and to live like a sovereign being I am boundless, total, and full. That is also important for you to know. You're in control of your own life. You are limitless. However, you are completely full and completely total just as you are. So there's nothing wrong with wanting more out of your life, but just know that everything that you could possibly want and need is already inside of you. And it's waiting for you to manifest it into an actual reality. So the third one is I am my own ultimate power. I think we all have issues with our own personal power. You know, especially when you're in relationships, you tend to give away your personal power to your partner. Um, or maybe if you're not in a relationship, you might do that in other relationships of your life, like your family members, your parents, your children, your siblings, your friends, maybe you're giving them more power over yourself in your life than you would like to. So it's important to establish your own power. I am supreme, absolute, and limitless. I am supreme, absolute, and limitless. Another affirmation that's stating the same thing basically. I have everything that I need inside of me, it's all there, I am enough, however, I am limitless. I can become whatever I want to be, I have unlimited possibility and potential. So we all say we know these things and sometimes it's just important to just remind yourself and sometimes when you're having a bad day, you can't remind yourself, so affirmations help. There was a period of my life where I was so low that I had to write affirmations down all over the place. Honestly, I had them in little pieces of paper like this tiny, and I put them <coughs> right next to the bed when I woke up, put them uh, in front of me in the bathtub, inside of my medicine cabinet, on my driver's, uh, on my wheel, on my driving side, put them everywhere that I, I could be surprised by them everywhere that I would run into them everywhere where I had a second free moment I would focus on those things and they hella worked for me so 
This is my new focus right now. I'm a sovereign being. I'm boundless, total, and full. I am my own ultimate power. I am supreme, absolute, and limitless. So I hope you know that you're all of those things as well. And if you don't, then you can feel free to practice them with me until you do feel that you are those things, okay? I love you guys, and I really do hope you have a great day.